How you doing folks? Allow me to please demonstrate this 2018 Sandpiper 8318. It is relatively new flow plan with a bunk room in it, multiple slides. She's about 40 feet long. Sorry, it's a bit windy out here today. We a barbecue that swings out. Two entry doors. And that's four slide outs. This here is a big outside kitchen. Nice sink. Lights. Four steps, six way leveling, automatic, of course. 32 inch entry, bigger than anybody's. Makes it very nice to walk in with that laundry basket if you want. Lots of storage, outside speakers, outside spray nozzle, all aluminum construction walls <clears throat> as I go in we'll see that we're looking at hard surface countertops right here this is a trifold sofa that makes into a big bed nice dinette <clears throat> center island and now let me close that door so we can get rid of this light reflection <clears throat> okay here we go so here's the rest of the kitchen A lot of room to prep, big TV, fireplace, Bluetooth, sound bar, the bigger 22 inch oven, not the 17, bigger microwave, again nice hard surface countertops, thick, see how thick that is? These are sort of molded stone, this is a French the refrigerator, we have all seen them at Costco, and we have more storage here, the big drawers, watch, see how soft that clothes was, let me do it again, all the drawers are like that, soft closing drawers, let me give you a picture from the back, ceiling fan, of course, two ACs, 50 amp service, both 15 amp, I'm sorry, 15 BTU <coughs> ACs on those, all the upgrade ones, pretty much a given. Okay, this is a bunk room that we're talking about. So I've got a couch here, I've got a bunk above it. So during the day, you don't need this. This is, by the way, the nice mattress, look at that. This is the good stuff, not the cheap stuff that turns all yucky. Okay, so this goes up and connects right there. And this becomes a day play area. And this also is a big bed. This is a complete trifold sofa right here. During the night, drop that, and now you have a big bed down here, single bed up here. Turn around, <clears throat> we've got a lot of storage, lots and lots of storage for the kids. Big closet, another, and take the stairs. We go up and let me show you we have a loft this way and a loft that way. Actually, let me turn that light on. There we go. Cubby right there for the kid. Another cubby there for the kid. And of course, the best part is where they have their own <coughs> bathroom. Shower, toilet, sink, all of it. They don't have to come into mama's bathroom. The kids, come from outside and stay outside. It's a very nice room. Stay in. And I did not point out all these nice LED accents. As I walk through the bedroom. Oh, let me mention this first. <clears throat> this is a 
the Medic thermostat that controls both ACs from it. And it controls the uh, furnace as well. This is the control panel. Dual stage water heater. You have of course an inverter that does the refrigerator power. This is a gen prep. So if you want to put a generator in it, it's all ready to go. You don't have to wire anything or run any extra electricity. It's all done by the factory. Makes it a lot easier on us too when you wish to purchase that option. Going through the bedroom. Very nice bed. 60 by 80. Nice. This is a Serta mattress. And four drawers here. Very pretty. Look at that. And then we have watch one more time. Oops. I missed it. I didn't push it hard enough. There we go. Bam. Big TV here. This, turn the lights on in here. Okay, these are the boxes for the televisions, obviously. Cubby there, washer and dryer combo. Go there and there. Actually, you get to split them if you want. The washer goes here and the dryer goes there. Two separate units. This here is a thermostat for that's connected to that domatic panel I showed you earlier that knows if it's getting hot in here. So it's smart enough to turn this AC on to cooler instead of having to make sure that that thermostat senses the temperature because if you've got to wait for that, that means somebody's going to freeze and somebody's going to overheat. That's what's good about it. Nice bathroom. Porcelain toilet. <clears throat> Very good counter space. I hate it we have no counter space. These have good counter space on them. And this shower is wider than your typical shower, so a guy like my size can fit in without hitting the glass with his elbows. Shower head is nice. Skylight. This is a new kind of fan now. For your toiletries. So this is very pretty. Got a blue light in there. So that's all she wrote, folks. Come and see this very beautiful Sandpiper 383. It is a gorgeous coach, and we'll treat you right, as always. Thank you.